it's me, Rosemarie Miller. I hope you all had an amazing weekend, and I'm here to bring you the latest crypto news and market updates. Let's get into it. The crypto market cap is just under $930 billion, which is up about 2% over the last day. On to our leaders and laggards. Leading our charts, we have Luna up 45%. Then there's Tron up just over 5% with Ethereum Classic up just over 1%. For our laggards, we have Polygon Matic, which is down almost 10% after its rally last week. Ave is down a little over 7%, and we have Chainlink down 7%. Kicking off the news today, Goldman Sachs has downgraded Coinbase from buy to sell. The investment bank set a price target of $45 for the stock, down from $70. As of this morning, Coinbase's shares were down 5%. Also happening earlier today, Voyager Digital issued a default notice against Three Arrows Capital for failing to repay their $675 million loan. Voyager says they're still operating and fulfilling customer orders and withdrawals. However, the withdrawals on Voyager are limited to $10,000 a day, down from $25,000 also limiting to 20 transactions per 24 hour period. Voyager's price fell 60% in the last week, but the company's stock opened at 71 cents this morning. Voyager Digital intends to pursue recovery from Three Arrows Capital and brought in an investment firm, Molas, as a financial advisor. For a little NFT news, it's being reported that the creator of Board A Yacht Club, Yuga Labs, is suing an artist who goes by Writer Rips for seeking to devalue the brand. Writer Rips allegedly created a copycat Board A Yacht Club called RR Board A Yacht Club. The lawsuit claims that original Board A Yacht Club images were used and accuses Rips of marketing the NFTs as official Board Ape products. Speaking of NFTs, OpenSea just announced they're teaming up with Clayton Foundation, an open source public blockchain, to accelerate the growth and adoption of NFTs in Asia. Harmony's Horizon Bridge fell victim to a $100 million hack, which is two thirds of its capital. Horizon is Harmony's main bridge between the Ethereum and Binance Smart Chain blockchain. It allows users to transfer assets like tokens, stable coins, and NFTs across the platform. There's currently over $51 million worth of BNB and Ethereum locked into the Horizon bridge. Harmony paused transactions and offered a $1 million bounty, saying they'll advocate for no criminal charges once the funds are returned. Offering bounties has become a pretty common practice in crypto, with the hacked parties asking for their money back. The security firm Elliptic estimates that over $1 billion has been stolen from blockchain bridges this year. 